Hey guys, and welcome back to Let's Play The Sims 3 Disney Legacy. We're here with Cinderella. I'm so happy that she's so pretty. I don't know, it just makes me happy to feel like I've created a beautiful sim. Anyways. <laughs> Anyways, so, um, Diana, or Prince Charming, is off at work. So, Cinderella is stuck at home. Um, uh, Diana's on her way home from school. And she needs to do her homework and she gets here. The babies are here. They are in their cribs. He is well taken care of. He just needs to sleep. And she's not so well taken care of. So we're going to have Cinderella come up here. Go ahead and change Jessie. Um, go ahead and let's see. Um, give bottle. You're going to snuggle. Play with snuggle and that should get her taken care of if she needs to change her diaper after that then she can otherwise i'm not too worried about it all right roxy you want to run around well, why don't you go ahead and do that um run around and then when you're done with that you're going to sniff out collectibles no 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 i want to go over here Thank you. She's got the hyper trait. That's fine. I don't really care. We made eight simoleons. Alright. Pom pom. You do what you gotta do. You wanna sniff pom pom? Where's pom pom? Come on, Bruno. Come sniff. Um. You wanted to find something special, so. You should be. For sniffing out collectibles as well. Alright, that gets you taken care of, and we're back with you. Alright. It looks like you didn't get peed on. <laughs> so, go ahead and just put her back in the crib, and then go ahead and clean the house. I don't know what you've done or what you need to do, but so be it. Where's Diana? Alright, Diana, let's get this done. She's like, I'm working on it, I'm working on it. You want to brush Roxy, sing karaoke, go fishing, and stay on the honor roll for three days. Well, you should have stay on the honor roll for three days um, done on Monday, so that would be good. It doesn't say three days straight, does it? No, it just says for three days. Okay. So, like I said, we'll have that done Monday. When she goes back to school. Because it's Saturday and Sunday right now. Now she ages up in less than a week. Um, and they age up in two days. And then Cinderella ages up. Six days. Oh, her and uh, Diana share a birthday. And then Prince ages up to an elder in 19 days. God help me. I don't want him to age up to an elder already. It feels like just yesterday we got married to him. I'm not going to lie. <sighs> But, I guess not. I guess we've been married longer than I remembered. Which is fine. That can happen. But, it just doesn't seem that way. Alright, do you have 20,000? No, you have 9,000. Alright, so we need to get you some more. He's already gotten that one. I really want to get them just a long distance friend. If that's the one that I can get them, that's what I'd like to go for. Alright, how are you doing on all of your skills of uh, the oven and the peg box do you even have these uh, objects you do come up here and play with blocks i want to see how good far along you are you found a gem and you got the hyper trait well we already knew about the hyper trait and the babies are sleeping so cinderella has done her duties she's taking care of her babies and they are very happy all right you're stuck in a loop you're stuck in a loop all right you can go downstairs what's the problem um, move the clothes to the dryer. Oh, we had Tiberium? Man, where's the Tiberium? I hear it popping. I have no idea. I have no idea. I don't know. I didn't know we even had Tiberium, to be honest with you, so... It's interesting. All right, go ahead and take care of this. <clears throat> she found some interesting, I do hear it. Go ahead and do your laundry. Where is it? 
I'm interested now. Cause I want. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa! We got money for days. What are we waiting on? <laughs> Nothing. All right, clean out the bad food, and then clean the house. I guess. I guess that's the way to do it. I don't know. And all of these seem to be pretty full, so nothing we can do there. All right. Well, at least we got rid of the nasty food. What else do we need to do? Do we need to serve dinner? Yep, it looks like we do. All right, serve up some. What's Diana's favorite food? Let's see. Diana, you like porcini risotto. I don't know if your mom knows how to make that. I think that's a recipe book. Um, and I don't think she's read the recipe books. We could get them for her. Um, all right, what's his favorite food? Autumn salad. What's hers? Pancakes. Autumn salad it is. <laughs> no. We always have autumn salad. Let's make ratatouille. I don't know what she just got rid of, but ratatouille sounds pretty good. Now it makes me want to get her the books to read all the recipes so she can make different things. Like mushroom omelets and stuff for dinner. Or breakfast. And he gets home at 9.30. Yeah, they should be eating. They should have already eaten. Alright, and how is she doing on this? Alright, so she is gaining skills. Which is good. I do want her to continue to build the skills. Once she makes this, I'm just going to let them eat. Because he won't be home for a little bit. Well, he might be home by that time, actually. Because she's got to still cook it. Found a gem. Alright, why don't you guys come on home and eat? You go ahead and eat from this bowl. You can eat from this bowl. And... You need to go upstairs and use the bathroom. So go ahead and use this. And then you can scratch. And you can eat. And then I'm going to let you play with this. And that should get a lot of your needs taken care of. Alright. He got a promotion to the Music Talent Scout as well as 612 simoleons. With the bands having their typical drama, they need to scout the local clubs for new talent. Who knows when they'll need a new drummer or bassist or singer or pianist or spouse of all the above. Or all the above. Grab the guitar and start learning a few chords. You never know when you'll need to jump on stage as a replacement. He, got six, he makes 60 simoleons an hour. It works from 5 p.m. to 10.30 p.m. Found something special. Found a gem. He made 280 today. Leading up the band's equipment is always a chore, but sometimes it can be a downright dangerous. A careless roadie almost damaged all the guitars out of the back of the bus while loading them, and it was even if it wasn't for Qu Prince's quick action to save the guitars, they could have taken some damage. Prince got a small cash bonus and a lot of ca congratulations. Okay, so that's why he pretty much got the promotion. I hear the baby upstairs crying. I know, I know. All right, come on down here, grab a plate. We'll get this taken care of. I know they're not eating like I normally have them do, but one time is fine. I do like making them eat together just because I feel like as a royal family, you would always eat together no matter what. Like you, your kids wouldn't eat later than you and you wouldn't eat before them or you wouldn't eat after them or whatever. Um, but I feel like sometimes business which is what Prince is going through, is a little bit more important. And so once in a while, maybe a meal would be missed together. But otherwise, I don't think that is the what would be happening with these guys. Because if she's Cinderella, she's a princess. So she would be royal. All right, what's wrong with this child? Everything. Go ahead and change his... No, don't change his diaper. Give him a bottle. Change Woody. Snuggle. Play with. Snuggle. Okay. And now he need, he wants to have five friends. We could do that. And why don't you go ahead and put away the leftovers real quick for me? And you need to get your musical skill up. 
got fatigue zero two times. I didn't know we were supposed to be getting fatigue, to be honest with you. So, I haven't been working on it. Alright, you're gonna go to bed. And my daughter, you're going to bed as well. When you get up, you're gonna take a shower and stuff for school. Alright, and you're taking care of the baby. That rain is just way too loud. Okay. When you're done, come on up here and go to sleep. We just got 144 simoleons in grant money from taking care of the house. We're still level 1. Funds to promotion 51 simoleons. Alright, so as long as we continue to do things today, we should definitely get a promotion to the next level of that career, which will be good. <clears throat> what are you two dogs doing? I don't think they know. Alright, you're going to chew on this. And then you're going to come up here, and you are going to sleep. And Roxy, you are going to chew on this. And you're going to continue to eat and then you're gonna come up here and you're gonna sleep all right and now the other baby's crying all right go ahead and put Woody in the crib and then you're going to go ahead and give her a bottle um I have to wait until he's out of your arms or classified as out of your arms I guess I should say change Jesse Um, go ahead and snuggle her, go ahead and play with her, and then go ahead and snuggle her one last time, and then you're going to put her in the crib, and then you're going to go to bed. <clears throat> Alright, this should work, hopefully. Oh gosh. I don't think that helped at all. Well, it did, but it didn't. Alright, how are you guys doing? You're eating. You want to get to eight of that? You want to guard the home? You're fatigued? Alright, well, that's fine. You're in bed. Good. You're in bed. Good. You're fatigued too. Good. Guess I worked you guys to the bone today now, didn't I? It's good. I want to work you guys. I want to get you guys to the point where you guys are maxed out on that. Now, Roxy is 34 days old. I don't know the max level or the max number of days for dogs. So I don't know what it goes to. So I can't give you an approximate number of how much is left. But you can see where she is on the bar. Now, Pom Pom ages up tomorrow. And Bruno ages up today. So Bruno will be an elder dog. And then Pom Pom will be an elder cat tomorrow. So we'll have three elder cats and, well, three elder animals within the house. Um, so we have to prepare for three animal deaths coming up soon. Which is not something I look forward to. I hope the babies are um, teens by then, but I don't know. Now, I'm not going to have any more children with Cinderella and Prince, just because they have the three. And Woody is going to be our heir, so the only boy that they had. Um, I love Diana, and I'm really sad that I didn't think to name her um, properly when she was born. But um, I didn't. Um... So, since we're going with Toy Story next, um, Woody will be our next one. I had thought about doing Jesse, but somebody had mentioned Jesse doesn't come in until the second movie, so it kind of doesn't make sense. Toy Story originated with Woody and Buzz Lightyear. So, if I had two boys, I was going to name the second one Buzz Lightyear, and then we were going to raffle it off. But, because we didn't, um, Woody and Jesse were the two that were named, so Woody will be our heir. So, he will be... Right now, he has the light sleeper and hates the outdoors, so it's going to be interesting. But, um, did he get a, he did get an imaginary friend, so we just need to make sure that he 
you know, gets that all leveled up. Anyways, while they're sleeping, I'm going to go ahead and cut out, and I will be right back when they're getting up for their day. Be back in just a second. All right, so Prince is up. I'm going to go ahead and get his needs taken care of, and we got a zombie friend. And this storm is actually really bad. It's a lot worse than I thought it was originally. Um, the storm is outside in their, of their house. Um, let's go ahead and take care of the babies because I'm pretty sure they're probably just about ready to get upset. So go ahead and take care of Woody. Um, snuggle him. Play with him. Snuggle him. I'm pretty sure he's, yeah, he's getting there. So this will be good. It'll take care of his needs. Get him to the point where he can do anything he needs to pretty much do tonight. Um... Now, remember, today's Bruno's birthday, so uh, we've got another dog aging up. I hate to see them age, because I know that that means the end is coming closer and closer. Roxy's already the elder dog. Um, and I don't know how it determines when the animals go. I know with Sims, it's kind of like based off of like athletic skills and how well of a life they had if they were happier throughout their whole entire life or if they were more angry throughout their whole entire life that all has that all plays into when they go on um for the humans and stuff like that on this but i don't know about the animals i'm pretty sure it probably has enough something to do with it not the athletic part but probably how well of a life they have lived <clears throat> so i'm i'm sure that probably has something to do with it Alright. <clears throat> he needs to get fatigued. Now, when is his first... When are his days off? Wednesday, Thursday, and Sunday. Got it. You need to get upstairs and go to bed, Roxy. I've told you 7,000 times to go to sleep. That is the last time I'm telling you. Seriously, dog, you have not slept barely any. <clears throat> because Roxy keeps getting up to go do other things, and that's what's killing her, is that she needs to be sleeping, and she's just choosing not to. She's just being very rebellious today. She's a rebellious old dog. Alright, um, he wants to have the five friends. Um... Does he know? Okay, if he can become friends with his boss, that'll be a fourth friend, which would be good. We just need to continue talking with everyone at work then. Rob Putnam, Eduardo Gills Carbo. That's a weird name, Eduardo Gills Carbo. It's Bruno's birthday today. Yeah, we know. We know, we know, we know. Alright, then you're going to snuggle, and you're going to play with, and you're going to snuggle. All right, and how are you doing? You're doing okay. Um, dog. Go to sleep. She's Louise. All right, you're a good dad, taking care of them. How good is your relationship with them? You're not quite friends with them yet, so this is good that you're taking care of them. It gets you the friendship. It gets you more of a friendship with them. That's good. All right, go ahead and take care of her and then put her in the crib. And then you're going to go downstairs. You do need to eat. Um, alright. Cinderella, when you get up, this stupid rain. Um, you're going to use, shower, and then we're going to pull out the food for breakfast, which is leftover life fruit pancakes. So. Oh, there's cake in here. Oh, wait, that's the cake to eat. <laughs> I did not mean to do that. Um this onto the table. Possibly. Yep, there we go. Alright, and he is going to... Well, I'm going to call the household to the meal. Not like that. You can grab a plate here. Um, grab a plate here. Man, I should have just told you guys to do this. The way it's going. Jeez. All right, well, hopefully they'll all get there at the same time. Now, Rainbow Gem, I'm going to give this to Woody, just in case he wants to use it to bring his imaginary friend to life that way. He'll already have it, so we don't have to worry about it. 
um, the dogs today. I am going to shuffle everything over to Cinderella. She's going to take it over and consign it. Or smelt it or whatever she's got to do with it. Um, I just kind of want to get it out of their inventory. Now some of it I can't. Like I'm not going to take out the fire hydrant stuff. But this other stuff is really good. This vampire's eye makes me so angry. You don't even know. I spent... I don't even know how many weeks in, in a sim game one time as a werewolf hunting for a vampire's eye. Couldn't find one for to save my life. These guys come up with it like the second day they go hunting. <sighs> Why didn't I have a dog? <laughs> I could have gotten a dog. I just didn't think about it, to be honest. It never even crossed my mind, which is sad because it should have. Anastasia, Lady Tremaine, Gisela. I don't know why I have these. I think... I don't think Lady Tremaine is no, any long... Like, I don't think she's alive any longer. I think she's passed away. Um, we are going to analyze all these. I think that's all that needs to be analyzed. And he... Don't worry about cleaning up. Your wife will do that. You're going to go ahead and start a jam session and just jam. That way, oh, and it's Saturday, so no one has, well, she doesn't have school, so that's good. Um, you're sleeping. I'm not going to mess with you. You're about to get up, so I'm going to tell you to eat. All right. You can go on upstairs and play with your blocks. All right, you go ahead and eat, scratch. Use the bathroom. You do need social. Um, and then we'll get you some social after that. Alright, you're about up, so go ahead and chew this. I don't know why I can't hear him. Eat from this bowl, and then I'm going to probably have you and Pom Pom talk. That's my plan for today. Can this rain stop? It's summer. It's not fall. Be nice if we could have one nice day just to go out with a family. Oh, can't do that. Can't give me a break. These guys age up tomorrow. Bruno ages up today. Got it. Alright, go ahead and analyze those. And does he have to work today? He does. In seven hours, though. So we have plenty of time to head out with Cinderella. All right, Cinderella, you're going to go ahead and do this. You are going to get this smelted, get this smelted, and then you are going to run over here to the elixir consignment. Um, yeah, we got to cut gems. I was going to say we could go to the other one, but we got to cut the gems. So pointless to go to a different one because you got to cut them. So you go ahead and work on this, and we're going to go with you. And I am going to sell these two out of our inventory. We're going to make a little bit of money on them, which is kind of nice. And this one's worth 260 Alright, we made over 300 so that's good. And it looks like the rain has stopped, finally. So that makes me happy. I would like to do some things outdoors with them for the weekend. Unfortunately, Prince has to work, so... He doesn't tomorrow, though, so he just has to work today. So we'll be, we'll do things just mom and Diana once he leaves. And then from there on, we'll do what we can do. She does want to improve her alchemy, catch a snake, and she wants to have a great date with Prince. I would love to have a great date with him. I would love it. Just doesn't seem like it's ever in the books for us to do anything but take care of kids at this time, point in time. But, I mean, I can kind of understand that in a way. We do have three kids. All under the age of teen. <laughs> Child and younger. So. These two are about to be toddlers. So we'll have a child and two toddlers. And Twin toddlers is never an easy thing to, to work with. It always ends up being a lot harder than you think. Alright. I am going to let you come up here. You're going to cut some gems. How many does she have? One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, oops, five, and six. The man has green. 
All right, and then you are going to buy. Go ahead and do the diamond. Do oval. Buy that. All right, she's done with that. I'm going to jump back over real quick with her. I do want to um, brush Roxy if Roxy is around and available. Roxy, where are you at? All right, you're sleeping still? Okay, I'm not going to mess with you because I had a really hard time getting you to sleep. So I'm going to let you sleep. Um, I'm going to buy an oven for you. Toy oven. And I'm going to get it in yellow. Just because I can. All right, you're going to come on over here, Miss Thang. Go ahead and stop playing with that. And you are going to bake muffins. <sighs> I need a new mouse. It just, like, doesn't like to move, and it's just really weird. All right, and you're just working on this. Um, let's go ahead and put these away. I know I probably should have Cinderella do it, but I don't want them to go bad before she gets back. And you're just working on the musical skill, which is good. The babies, how are they doing? Mm, not so great. But mom should be back soon. I mean, she's just got to buy these and consign them, or cut them and consign them. So by the time she's ready... By the time she's done with this, they'll be ready to be taken care of. Okay. So you got one of them. Let's go ahead and cut the moonstone. We're going to do pear cut now. We don't have the heart shape, unfortunately, which is the most expensive shape to cut. Um, and we don't have it because we haven't collected 15 gems on our own, I believe. So... If we had done that, we would, but we don't. So, we're just what we got. Alright, go ahead and do the pink diamond. Do pear. Oh, I would have been so mad if I clicked gem dust. I can tell you that much. Alright. You're outside chasing the ball. Um... Yeah, go ahead and goof around with the dog. That'll get you guys taken care of. Alright, three more. Pear cut. And I see the babies over there going yellow. There's nothing I can really do. She's baking up a storm. Has she burnt any? She didn't have any in her inventory yet. Alright, well that's fine. Just get this done and I will be <laughs> so happy to get this stuff on consignment. I'm probably going to consign these photos, as, these portraits as well. We don't need them. Alright, sunstone. Do that. Hmm. Alright, we just got the vampire's eye next. And we should make okay money off of this, which would be good. It's not like this family is rich, so any money they can make from the dogs or whatever is free money to us. So that's nice. Alright, vampire's eye and pear cut. Alright, and then we're going to come down downstairs and we're going to work with you and sell all this stuff off to you. <clears throat> I just thought that person that was a person. I'm not even lying to you. I thought it was someone texting, but it's not. Oh, those stupid bees. They're so annoying. Alright, she's going to come on downstairs. Alright, she's up to level one of that. That's great. Whoops, don't leave me behind. Oh, that one's horrifying. Get rid of that one. Not gonna eat it. Alright, at least we're taking care of it. Okay. Mm. Are you gonna let me do this? Okay. Go ahead and consign... Let's see. Consign this, and this, and this. And there's my time. Yes, yeah, so you're gonna have to wait a minute. This one, this one, this one, this one. This, this. See, these are worth a little bit of money. Which is nice. These are worth quite a bit of money. So we'll make some good money off of this, which is good. Alright, go ahead and consign those items. These are just seeds and stuff, so if we wanted to work on that, we could. Um, don't think there's anything in here that I want, so I'm just going to go ahead and send you on home. I do want to grab the gifts with her real quick before I get off of here. 
That's why I haven't stopped the episode yet. Alright, let's see. You've got two of these muffins in here, and they're both nice. Oh, one's great quality. That's good. Let's go see how close you are to leveling up that skill while she's on her way over here. Um, I don't see a bar over your head, but it's probably just the game. There it is. Okay. So, I'm going to put these muffins in this refrigerator down here. Because they're good, so... They deserve to be in the fridge for someone to eat. Alright, how are you doing on the guitar? He's like, I don't know, I'm just working on it. Alright, when do you have work? In three hours? Two hours. Okay, let's do this. Stop doing that. Come on in here, use this, and take a shower real quick. And before you come all the way inside, I want you to go ahead and accept gifts from a friend. And his carpool will be here in an hour. Yeah, I know. The babies, unfortunately, are going to be unhappy at the very beginning of the next episode, but we'll be instantly taking care of them. Alright, this one is from Dean08. It's a message from the game. Going to take it here. We just got a small ivy. Thank you so much. I can't send back gifts because I've sent back quite a few today, so thank you so much for that. I really appreciate it, but fortunately, I can't send back. This is from Isaac Play Sims 3. Thanks for the picnic table. You're so very welcome, and thank you for a telescope. All right, this is from Lucas Polly. It says, you're the bomb.com. Aw, thanks for saying that. And thank you for a vial of potent bliss. The next one is um, from 180686car. It's a message from the game. We want to take it here. We just got a jar of potent friendship. Thank you so much for that. That's perfect. This is from Pizzazza Girl 1015 It says, please give this to any LP that you're currently playing in. All right, well, I'm playing right here. And we got a sleeping no McMulty. All right, thank you so much. And that is all the gifts. I'm going to go ahead and stop her before I get off. Because I know that if I don't do this now, I'm going to freak out. This is why I didn't hear the babies crying. They're sleeping. Um, I'm going to just tell her that she needs to come up here and do this. So that she knows when I get on next time. When I get on next time, I know what I'm working on. Um, play with... Snuggle, and then you're gonna give bottle, change Jesse, uh, snuggle. Okay, so at least I know what she's working on. And then Roxy, Roxy, you need to be eating and chewing this. And you're gonna talk with Bruno. Friendly, socialize. Friendly, socialize. Friendly, socialize. Friendly, socialize. Friendly, socialize. This is just... This is just setting up for the next episode is all. Alright, so if you guys like this, please don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. In the next one, we'll see Bruno age up. We'll probably see the children age up as well. Um, and then... Pom Pom will age up. So we've got probably four birthdays in the next one. And then after that, we're waiting on Mom and Diana to age up. Diana will be a teen. And Cinderella will be an adult, a full-fledged adult. So we'll be nearing the end of Generation 1 with Cinderella. I'm sad to see her go, but I'm excited to get into the next generation with Woody. Um, so he'll, like I said, he'll be our heir. Anyways, guys, if you guys liked it, please don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe to my channel. In the description below, there is a donation link. If you'd like, donate to my channel, along with things like my Facebook fan page, my Twitter, my Twitch links. So if you'd like to check out those and follow me, that would mean the world to me. And I will talk to you guys in my very next one. Thanks very much for watching.